Good afternoon, everyone. This is Ingara Carmella. I can medium Lisa speaking. I do hope everyone is well. This 29th day of May. Um, this reading I picked up on. If you can just bear with me, because I do get tongue tied. I picked up on about teachers and finances and teaching teaching others that have been misfortunate by the COVID-19 and it's those teachers that are, how can I put it, uh, trying to help those that need the help to raise awareness, to get people motivated. Uh, these teachers could possibly very well be if you're a musician if you're a writer if you're a medium like myself a psychic or, or somebody who, who works on the internet Earning, earning, um, earning their living through the internet, and they're aiming to help others, to teach them what they know, to help other people to gain confidence to put their ideas together to help them to be creative and use that creativeness to to earn um, to earn a living either through the internet are looking for work but, it, but it's all about the strength what you teachers have it's all about your strength your intuition and, and, and being able to balance and juggle your own creativeness your own your own ideas and it's been able to juggle them to juggle them out to balance them so if you can just bear with me <laughs> as you can see and if I um, show you the meaning how my angel cards come out Because I do rever I do reversal. And the upright position. And as you can see. The two of Ariel is in reversed. And it's what I call of. Is what I call a negative aspect of yourself or a, a negative situation that surrounds you. When you put it in the right way up, it's what I call a positive aspect of yourself, um, a positive situation that's a, that is surrounding you. But in today's reading, it's reversing. It's all about juggling. Butterfingers, I've dropped my card again. Here we go. 
uh, you'll probably be having a laugh go, trying to watch this video with my butter fingers and my tongue tied trying to get my words out as I see things um, as you can see in the two of Ariel it's all about juggling and balancing uh, your creative the creative ideas while you're working and teaching others to help to help those to get motivated so it is basically about motivating others uh, who have been in lockdown and been misfortunate and in the in this lockdown and have been misfortunate and have lost their jobs and they've got no finances coming coming in but as I was saying this COVID-19 has, has been able to help you teachers to sit back and think things through and to stand up for what you actually believe in as it says at the bottom of this seven of Gabriel st stand up for what you believe in have confidence claim your personal power so a lot of teachers do tend to have leadership and are able to perhaps cope with the demands of other people who are trying to learn things, to learn new things. But the sick, sorry, but it is a new beginning. It is a new beginning and COVID-19 I feel that many people, here we go again, have dropped it. I feel that many people have put a lot of things on hold because they've not known what is going to happen. And many ideas, uh, especially where finances are concerned, have been put on hold. Um, but now it's time now it's time to start and get those uh, cogs in the wheels working again to do what you're really passionate about and to organise yourself so you can actually make if I can get this so you can actually make passionate choices about what you're doing even though it's the lovers it's, it does concern relationships but it's not a personal relationship it's more to do with relationships that you encounter that who you are teaching but you are making passionate choices from the heart as you can see from this it, it, this is how I came to the conclusion of my angel reading that it is about teachers out there teaching somebody else but you also need to sort of sit back and look at the other person's point of view instead of um, I, I don't know how to put this it, um, it, it sit back and look at the other, other person's point of view as it says there 
but at the moment it's in reverse, so we don't always tend to see the other person's point of view when we're really focused on something that we're doing. But if you can just slow yourself down and think things through, you and turn this card the right way up, you, you should be able to see the other person's point of view because as you're going along, um, doing what you do passionately, uh, we do, uh, we do rise. We do rise by lifting others up, and that's the positive quote for today. We rise by lifting others up. So I do up this insight. I put this the right way up. <laughs> I do hope this, um, and remember to balance things out, <laughs> I do hope this reading, um, this angel card reading, because I've worked it, worked it all out in numerology, um, which, I seem, which helps me to get a more in-depth sight of a uh, what I call uh, life vibrations in the air. So I do hope this has helped you to sort your to sort out what you're going through and to be able to help others out as I'm trying to help you out with my angel card reading so thank you for watching this reading and i shall see you next week thank you